What up, YouTube? This is Woody coming back with another mother love and mother vlog. Today we got a package. This package come in the mail. We're gonna open it. Find out what it is. What could it be? Obviously motorcycle related. Let's see. Uh, uh, oh, this is exciting. Uh, uh, boom! So, as you saw in the previous video, I was getting a helmet. I got my helmet. Cena Momentum Light. I got the light because I don't need the... I felt like it was the best fit for me as far as the momentum lineup goes. I felt like it was the best for me because I don't ride with people, but if I do, the uh, Cena SMH10, I think is what it is built into the light is good enough for me if I rode with a couple people otherwise. But yeah, let's look what it is. See what it looks like. Interesting box. Lots of padding in there. In the bag. Getting in it. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this helmet. Nice, nice bag. That's what she said. Yeah, that's a nice bag. Open it up real fast. Interessante. Okay. And down here. Interesting. Open it up. It's going to be tough to do with one hand. We're going to make it happen. Hold on a second. A little bit more there. Oh, dude, I can't wait to ride with this helmet. Let's see if I can. Just a second. All right, there we go. There we go. Dude, I can't believe. Oh, my gosh, I'm so excited to wear this helmet. Oh, I'm so glad. Oh, my gosh, I can't believe it. I can't. I'm stoked. I'm stoked. I'm stoked. Boom. Oh, I love it. I love the mat. Uh, I love the mat. Pinlock system. Anti scratch visor. Remove. Fully removable and washable liner. Tinted lenses are not suitable for on a. Dude. Dude. Oh, I haven't had to wear a D ring in a while. My, uh. Uh, speed and strength tap out helmet that I got has the quick release So that's gonna be Different than what I'm used to using but I've used them before Look at that big big vent right there Big vent right there. Oh, I can't wait to ride in this helmet all my This is like a blow-up pad for it then to charge it, which I'll probably do first thing, plug it in. Um, I'll probably do a couple rides without with it. Oh my gosh. Looks like it might be tough to put a camera on. I might have to mount my camera over here and bring it across or something. We'll see. Uh, I can't wait to start riding with this thing. Uh, I can't worry. Anyways, so I'll probably uh, get it all charged up and I'll play with it a little bit around the house, wearing it, getting used to the buttons and the controls and stuff like that. And then uh, spring is right around the corner. So, and then I'll be able to uh, really get out and ride with it and I'll do a review on it. So I can't wait for that. But that's it. That's the helmet I got. Seen them. Momentum. Light. I got a big head, extra large. That's what she said. 
Um, this thing come a week early. Holy crap. This thing came a week early. Um, I shopped around and shopped around and shopped around. Okay. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like I shopped and shopped and shopped looking for the cheapest one, the best price. Cause that's what I, that's what I do. Anyway. So I want, I was holding out to see the Atlas, uh, Rorock helmets come out and see what they were going to cost. And I'm telling you, I love the looks of those helmets. They are bay for sure. But they're anywhere from $450 to $400. The plain matte one is $400. Probably totally worth it. I really like the looks of it. It's They're awesome looking helmets. But then you have to pay another $150 for the shockwave system that plugs into the back. So you can use the Bluetooth system that's already really in the helmet. Only thing that you're paying extra for is the brain for it, basically. Um, that's what uh, kind of set me off about it. I didn't want to go into that over $500 price range. That's why I went with this one. It felt like this is the best bang for your buck. I feel like at three, I paid three nine sixteen for that. Three hundred sixteen bucks. I found it. Uh, on Amazon, three hundred sixteen dollars uh, with taxes, free shipping, and it come out to three forty. So I'm stoked. So that's the cheapest I found it. The the Cena Momentum Light is it's the bottom the base model Momentum helmet. And then the next step up would be the the Momentum, which has the 20s uh cena system in it and then the next step up for that would be the pro maybe the ink i think it's the ink and that one has the um sound control thing on it i didn't feel like i needed it um because i keep hearing uh people say that this is a really quiet helmet to begin with so yeah anyways that's it. That's the video. I can't wait to start riding with this helmet. Thing looks sick. I love it. I love it. I've always liked my tap out helmet. It's got a cool design on it and it's kind of minimal. Like it's not too crazy. But I, dude, I love that. Minimal, no flash to it or nothing like that. Just simple. Can't get, I can't wait. I can't wait to start riding with it, start recording with it and uh, see how it all pans out, um, but we'll see. I'm gonna end the video here, and I'll catch you on the next video. I can't wait. Uh, be looking for review of this helmet. I'll be doing one, and uh, I can't wait, I can't wait. Anyways, that's the video. Peace. Just tripping on day, dreams got dirty, little lullabies playing on. All right, one last thing for the video before I really end it. Um, let me know what you guys think of this new character. See if you want to see him on more videos coming up. <laughs> let me know.